slowly but surely kung bumanat ang Pinoy knockout artist na si Reb Gentle Giant Santillan at matapos ang labindalawang sunod-sunod na panalo sinubok ang lakas ng Pinoy boxer nang ikasa sa parang makina walang tigil kung sumuntok na Koreano na si Sook Yun Yun si Yun ang OPBF welterweight champion ng panahon na yun sa round 1 tumira na ang champion na Koreano gustong palambutin ang Pinoy fighter to Sen sa mga balitang tinanggap natin si Santillan talaga nakakondisyon siguro kailangan makuha niya ito sa maagang panahon kung hindi the fourth rank in the world na ngayon itong si Santillan because of his series of successes both in the Philippines and some fights dahil kalaban niya sa Thailand din ah okay correct o nga naman o nga naman paano natin makakalimutan si Miss A pang bihira ka naman sa iyo party or an acquaintance getting to know you immediately good Santillan todo na suntok ha hindi siya ngayon eh pero ngayon first round pa lang sumusuntok na silang marami the Korean looks very aggressive tries to keep the jab working measure the distance of the jab but a good right by the Korean Neil Santillan and now it starts his parang walang tigil ang kamay niyan mantala si Santillan naman alam natin knockout artist ang ang problema na kay Santillan sir pag minsan naman Of course, Santillan fighting out of the Waki Salute stable. Waki, of course, is our promoter here tonight. Series of uh, right crosses. It's changed by to be a constant fighting machine. Wala, walang atras, no? Walang atras, no? Puro pasok, eh. Tsaka ang kamay niya, parang pisto, no? Nandun, no? Nandun. Kailangan dito talaga si Santillan medyo kondisyon. Dahil sa pagdating siya ng gitna ng, ano, delikado yan. It's clean. Speak in span in the corner of the Korea. So Kenyon is the BF welterweight title. Good right by the Korean. Kasi si Santillan yan sa ibang kaliwit eh. Siya dapat ingatan ng tayo na ang Korea na yun yung kaliwa ni Santillan. It would be the biggest fight of his career. No question about it. Jab constantly at work for Suk Yun Yun and that right tags the right cheek of Santillan. Body work now that this time by Suk Yun Yun. Left to the face of Santillan. Alam mo sir, walang tigil ang suntok ng Koreano eh. Parang perpetual motion na kanya, no? Yung bang sige na sige na sige. Yes. Pantala naman si Santillan, naghihintay siya ng magandang opening. So far, a minute going by. It's just a little over a minute going by us here in round number two. Again, we'd like to thank all our dear friends for making this raw. Of course, this is one of the landmark events, not only for the waterfront, but for boxing and for the city of Cebu as well. Boxing dealer, Siong Yen, Puli, Daan, na Cameron. Back, we're catching the tail end of the Sinulog. Fighters taking on each other strongly. Santillan trying to work at the Korean who gets jolted. A right to the head. The Korean is in trouble. He might be ready for the ball. Santillan working very hard, working on the face area of the Korean. The Korean is in a day, so Kyung Yun unable to throw anything, but there are some short replies. So Kyung Yun trying to work on the chain of Santillan, and suddenly a flurry of punches by the Korean. Well, medyo na grogi yung Koreano pero bumarik, ano? Medyo na nasaktan din si Santillan doon, pero ngayon tumatama si Santillan na maganda. Yes, Santillan with a right cross and a straight to the body. Another one to the face. Crowd getting excited here. Approaching the final 20 seconds, uppercut, bloodies the Korean, and the Korean is getting serious punishment here. His crown suddenly in jeopardy here. Santillan being egged on by the hometown crowd. Dumudugo na ang ilong ng Koreano. And the final 10 seconds now just being sounded. Santillan with a solid second round. In the meantime, third round action just crawling in. Suk Yun Yun, the defending champion in the wide trunks and a bit of blood already on his trunks. He welterweight champion. Mahirap kalaban itong Koreano. Yes, yes. Buntan ng buntan, no? Mukha naman yun si Santillan. Bit to the face and another straight to the face that connects on Santillan. In the meantime, the body shots by the Korean. He's seizing the initiative. Santillan in a bit of trouble here. The Korean, however, being jolted by ferocious shots to the face. Korean slowly developing into a bloody mess. Kanyang laba si Santillan ng face kay na walang tigil. Kailangan makamera si Santillan makaboxing muna. First Santillan winning against the Korean Singdam Bakuren. The Thailander, rather, in a fourth round win. Just... 
Body shot by Santillan. Ngayon ko, yun ang dapat na gawin sa Nisan Tanya. Puro sa katawan mo na ng Koreano sa Smoldok. Test na yung bodega, ano ha? Oo, dahil hindi malakas ang uh, katawan ng mga, ano, ng mga diba di tibay dyan yan. And that's what's in the mind of Santillan right now. In the meantime, the Korean, however, is a pesky customer. Ayo to Miguel, no? Oo, oh, Santillan. Box himself out of trouble here. That second round clearly going Santillan's way. But the initiative, just being seized here by the Korean, has thrown the more lethal punches. But Santillan as the round approaches its last 25 seconds. With some telling blows. Is the Korean on the way down? But he looks like a tough customer. Kala ko yung mga tamang yung receive, lalaglag na Koreano, pero... Eh, maganda ang balance, oo, eh. Oo, andun pa rin, eh. Matibay at matapang. That's why, tama yung advice mo. Maybe they must work or something else. Oo, ano, puro katawan muna. Ang suntok ni, ano, ni... Now, it is the Korea taking it strong. Santillan with an uppercut, but the Korean with those short shots that may be telling on Santillan. The Korean corner is a beehive of activity. Santillan with a short shot, quick counter. Nakakatakot dyan, Seb, dahil yung Koreano, sumutusuntok sa may makapagpahina ang gano'n. At yun ang malalaban ang ganyan laban si Santillan. Yung walang... Korean developing into a bloody mess in the second round, but ang style of Korean, one-two, 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 oh, one-two, one-two. Hindi niya inilalakas. Uh, basta uh, suntok lang lang suntok, tapos may bigla. Yung presence lang ba? Oo, oh, yun. Oh, that uppercut. Oh, oh that jolted sa kailan. Something sees talent. Good shot by the Korean. So Kim Yun continues to keep up the pace. Dictated the pace of the fight, actually. Talaga. Siya nagdadala ng laban. Ah, ah. It's something that the Korean corner tried to work on very quickly as we move into just about the final 40 seconds of this, the fourth. You do not want to meet this Korean on a lonely night. It reminds you of a Japanese fighter that uh, Flashy Lord punished so many times, Taruko Saka also. Yeah. Kept going in, boring in. Santillan in the meantime trying to make hay while the sun is shining, while the round lights. Oh, because sana yung Korean do sa style na yun. If Santillan thinks na let up yung Korean, I don't think that's going to happen. Oh, oh. Seriously. Yun, yun mga ganun sa katawan. He was able to do that in the second round, but how can you agree? There are three uh, judges, of course, Engineer Luciano Babiera of the Philippines, King J. of Korea, and, as I mentioned, Mr. McTavish, the referee. Good job by the Korea. That job is constantly working. Tuloy hindi makatapo ng suntok ng ganong karami si Santillan. Santillan, oo. Pero kung ako si Santillan, mamapaya ako lang yung ganon. Eh, kailangan pagtan... No, kasi sumignal yung referee sa mga kurado natin, ano? Oo! Oh, pera, pera! Oh! Grogi yung Koreano. The Korean is down for the count. Up at seven. Bruce McTavish asking the Korean if he's all right. Santillan sensing the possibility of being crowned champion here today. What will it happen? Let's see. The Korean has proven to be a tough customer in the course of the fight, but he has been tagged. A knockdown has happened here. Santillan receiving punishment as well. And Santillan hard at work. The Korean being tagged left and right. The uppercut missing there. Santillan continues to ride on the crest of the excited crowd. Matapang yung Koreano. Ang yes. ganda ng mga tinatama ni Santillan, pero nakatayo pa rin. Take nothing away from the Korean, but the Filipino red Santillan. Oh, nandun naman ulit ang Koreano. All he needs is a brief respite, and then he's back at work. Santillan still cautious as ever, as the Korean now continues to launch his attack, but the uppercut right on the chin. Another one to the chin of the Korean. Su Kyun Yun, a sitting duck for the uppercut of Santillan. Pero ito na naman, nandiyan naman ang Koreano. Wala naman tigil ang suntok ni A.K. Santillan. That jolts at the Korean, but the Korean continues to fire away. This has been a slugfest, no question about it. Uppercut jolting the face of Santillan. Santillan receiving serious punishment here. Taggering the Korean just a tad there. But the uppercut beginning to connect for Sukyun Yun. 
Santillan not throwing anything here. We have Both fighters now bloody. That shot to the chest by Santillan. Slight open out of him in the fifth round. Yeah, nga, yung bangsak na yun, dapat doggy panggalin yung Korea. Ikilang ka sa Santo ng Koreano. And tingin ko, naubos po si Santillan. Final seconds. Loko! Di naman naman na maganda yung Koreano. Medyo doggy yung Koreano, pero talaga napakatapang lang. Matapang, matibay, and he is the OPBF welterweight championship. And it is being defended by the Korean who is Ooh. at the end of Santillan with a major connection there, but the Korean continues to fire away. He will not go quietly into against him in this particular fight. He is the visitor here, you know? Right. Mabigat na lang, makatulad yan nga. May point deduction na siya. Missing, knockout. Right, right. Knockout or Tigeo. Three straight connections, four, five, six, and the mouthpiece of the Korean is out. The Korea buckles down, and the gloves are on the mat. He's at the count of four. This is the second knockdown. Okay. Yes, they're not angling my piece. Dapat yon ilalagay ng corner man, pero hindi ba okay ng corner man dahil dahil sa tagiliran. And the Korean back pedals. He's tilted, and Santillan is hard at work. He senses the opportunity. The Korean seems to have nowhere else to go. Na baka na ni Magtevis. Pagkati naman ng maganda, awatin din ni Magtevis. Pero hindi, pumapalit ang Koreano eh. Oo, tumatapon pa rin eh. Kahit pa paano eh. Talaga. At saka ngayon, oh. Para bang nakakamero siya pala. Pero siyang umabad, ang umapasok, oh. Alam mo, pinaka-jot. Uppercut, pati ipin eh. Oo, dahil sa usually, pag uppercut, dulo ang tama eh. Saka yung nerves natin sa ipin area, very sensitive lahat dyan. Buong katawan mo talaga nararamdaman yung jot. And it looks like the Korean of Santillan slipping there. He went flying. Good shots by the Korean. Although oh, he... Oh, there's also a Korean one. He's also a Korean one. He's also a Korean one. That is a concern. And there's a cut on the Korean now. Yes. Santillan. Yes. But there's a lot of damage. You're still going to hit it. Shot to the bread basket. The Korean, however, taking it strongly against Santillan. Short shots to the face, coming in quick succession. Right hook, finding its mark by the Korean. Santillan loves to finish the round strong. Santillan with the punishing blows. He gets jolted as well. Santillan so far with a well-planned uh, fight. Executing uh, their strategy well, however... Oh, the uppercut is the one that's working for Santillan and the crowd has been clamoring for that. Oh, that jab. Korean trying to readjust his mouthpiece also. Rapid succession of punches by the Korean Sukyunyon. Santillan trying to again end the round with a flourish. Yes! This one, this has literally been what the title is, the brawl at the waterfront. Yung ano, yung rubber noon, yung attraction. Oh, yung rubber noon, yung attraction. Oo. Oh, Santillan is in trouble. At sa Koreano, pasok ng pasok, suto na tuktok eh. Daptis, daptis, di lang naman eh. Oo. Uy, malaki na ang putok ng Koreano. Oo, yes. Malaki na ang putok. Santillan senses that. Second win dito sa Koreano ito dahil palagi nasa harapan mo. He's passed opponents into submission. Keep in mind that Santillan is putting on the line here his undefeated record of 11 straight. There have been two knockdowns, both as well as in the seventh. A point has been deducted from each of the fighters against the Korean in the fifth and against Santillan in the eighth. So, tingin ko dito. Good shot by the Korean. Oh, partially slipping there. And look at Santillan. He loves the end of the round. This again, para magi impressive sa mga sa mga ayamu mapagod. Oh, ordinaryo suntok yung ilabot niya. Santillan's on the move. 
He now seizes the initiative when he hears the signal for the last 10 seconds. Uh -huh. Manali Santillan, but from a boxing uh, fan perspective, it's been a good, entertaining fight for the fans, ano, huh? Talaga, uh -huh. in deciding round. And Santillan knows it. Can ill afford of uh, Rev Santillan. Medyo nadudulas na konti si Santillan. Oo. Oh. Dahil nga madalas, madalas nang ina, matalot, manalo ito, dapat tumayo tayo, talakpakan natin itong ating kababayan. Because may benefit of the doubt kahit papano yung champion eh. Oo, oh, oh, oh. uh, ako, so, so far, sa, sa ano, marami yung patama yung ano, pero ilang, oo, oh, matapang eh. Ilang beses ng yogi na yogi talaga, pero... Uy, good shot by the Korean, but will he have enough time? Final half minute. Uy, Medulas na talaga. Santillan is in trouble. He has no grip on the canvas. He is now being punished by the Korean. Unable to answer. Oh, hindi na halos makasuntong Santillan eh. Actually, para nag-aaway sa puti kitong oh. dalawa ko eh. Oh, tamama naman si Santillan. Ano ko ginawa naman yung Koreano? Uy! Uy, well, nadulas mo lang si Santillan. Hindi mo bumaksak ha. And what a fight actually. And... Judge Kim J. Kuhn scores it 113-111 for Suk Hyun Yun. Judge Luciano Babiera Jr. scores the bout 115-109 for Rev Santillan. And our scoring referee, Bruce McDavish, scores the bout. 114-111. For the winner, by split decision, and the new welterweight champion of the Korea Pacific Boxing Federation, well, the gentle I giant, Referee McDavish took into major consideration those two knockdowns, a point deduction as well. Grabe ang ipinakitang puso ni Reb Santillan sa laban. Pagod, marami na mga tama, pero lumaban pa rin hanggang sa dulo. Iba talaga ang mandrigmang Pinoy. So yan po ang gusto kong ishare sa inyo ngayong araw sa mga kaibigan at kababayan natin dyan sa Pinas, mga boxing fans, at sa mga tulad kong OFW, saan man panig sa mundo, kumusta po kayong lahat dyan? Kung nagustuhan niyo po itong aking video, like at kung pwede, mag-subscribe na din po kayo. At para updated kayo sa aking mga video, pwede nyo i-click ang notification bell. Maraming maraming salamat sa inyong panonood. Shout out kay Mr. Billy Jubildad ng Tagig at Pampanga, kay Ms. Madam B, Bill Mahamfreyes, kay Mr. Ricardo Bernaldo Jr., J.R. Pisamut Sari, kay Mr. Dong Tangloy Malyari, Jen Merjan Garcia ng Macau, Prince Evan Mangonon ng Imus Cavite, kay Mr. Ronnie Corillo, Orlando Season ng Mabalakat, Pampanga. Maraming maraming salamat po sa pagsuporta nyo sa aking channel.